Hey guys, it's Alexa Giovanni here, and guess what I picked up today? <laughs> Animal Crossing Amiibo cards, series one to four, and I'm so stoked because these in Australia only have come in three cards per deck, unlike the American ones, which come with six cards per deck. So I've been really hanging out to open this deck. So I think we should get started. Series one to four, didn't know which one to pick, so I've picked one of each. If you haven't already subscribed, subscribe and hit the like button right now. Before you continue, hit the or like. else, hit the like. <clears throat> All right, this is the first deck. So this is series one. So we've got, what is that? Walker. Oh, Molly. She's adorable. And Lyle. So I'm pretty sure these guys you cannot invite to your island. So I haven't tried these yet, so I'm very curious to see how they work. But these guys you can, I think, take photos on Harv's Island. These guys you can invite. So I think this one might be coming to our island. Series one. These have already been pre-torn because I just couldn't help myself. So we've got Bo. That is a sought after card. I think someone wants this guy on our island. Olivia, freaky eyes. She's a little bit cute. She's got a little bit of a mole on her face. I do dig that. And if you like cats. And the special card, we've got Layla, who looks like some sort of freaky turtle thing. Cool. Series three. I don't know if they get any better with every series, but let's see what this is like. So we've got Stinky, who looks somewhat, some sort of like Mexican wrestler. Born on the 17th of August. Crackle. It's funny, it's a pig. Crackle, everyone likes a bit of Crackle. That one's just kind of freaky looking, but cute. And Pally, special edition, shiny. Can you see that? That's pretty cool. Series three, series four. Sydney, pretty appropriate, coming from Australia. Another pig, Lucy, what is up with the pigs? Is that the third pig? Second, third pig. Second pig at least. And then we've got Lottie who I've got no idea who that is, but it looks like it's Pascal's wife or daughter or something. Might have to look into that later on. These have been taped up like Fort Knox. All right, so there are 24 decks here. So I've got five, five of each, so there's 20. 20 decks in total, so I'm just wondering, do I go in series order? Do I go by color? Let's go series four, series three, series two, series one. Let's just go numeric. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm really hoping for, I have got a wish list of these things. Don't remember what they are. I should cut these. Are you ready? Because, Phil? I've seen Phil set that many times when I go villager hunting. I always skip over that one. Bill, another duck. For some reason, this guy has been in the top charts as the nicest and cutest looking jock. I think my wife will be happy for this one. And Timmy, the two bros. All right. It is. I don't know what Happy Home Designer is. I don't think it's on the Switch. I think it's on the older version. So I'm going to go with the second card here. I'm not sure if I can do this without hurting the cards. All right. So 
Deck number two, Truffles, Pigmania in this deck. Sheldon, I've never seen this one before. Some sort of squirrel. Looks like it's a, I don't know, anything else but. And then we've got this Cap'n dude. Don't know who he is. Looks like a turtle of sorts. Next. Is this still a serious one? Yes. Just double check. I thought I might have opened the wrong ones. What are you guys hoping for? I'm hoping for some cool jocks. Or crankies. Oh, Axel. I thought Axel was one of the new Animal Crossing special release ones, but I'm thinking of a different elephant. Oh, Willow, it's one of the cute sheep. I don't know if it tells you what sort of type they are. And old Tortima. Again, probably came late to the series with Animal Crossing, so I don't know the history for these guys. Should I keep going with this range? Series one? Do you think? All right. Okay. I just keep seeing this one all the time. And I keep saying no. For those of you who like Anteaters, I'm not sure I'm a big fan, but it is what it is. It's Annalise or Annalisa. We've got Snake and Red Special. This guy never sells me the right stuff that I want. Always have to go to someone island, someone else's island to pick up his stuff. And the last deck in this pack. Just get rid of some of this junk. Oh, suspense. Suspense. I think I had a sneak peek. Opal? It's got a freaky little like little fringe going. Lopez, another antelope. Your deer. Antelope. And Isabel, the one that never gives you any news every time you start the game. Occasionally but she often finds her socks in the laundry or calling up her parents. That's it from that deck. Let's get started for the next ones. So this is series two. So we've got another five packs of these. We've already opened the sixth packet, which we had, just for recap, we had Layla, Olivia, and Bo. So I'm starting to recognize that there is some sort of coloring system to these. So it looks like they're based on their um, star sign. I think someone told me, a little bit. So let's have a look at what's in this one. So this is series two. So there are four series, all of which have around about a hundred cards each in each, uh, in each series. So what we've got is We've got Hugh, who's another pig. What are we collecting pigs today? Did someone just give me the pig shortlist? Then we've got close to pig, but Rhonda. So Rhonda's a um, sort of like a funny looking rhino, almost Annalise, Annalisa style. And then we've got my mate Jack. Jack, the guy who comes at uh, Halloween. So he's kind of cool. I like him. He's nice and shiny. Can you see the shininess? I like that. Jack is cool. Jack's a good special edition. So Jack, please trio over here. Let's get rid of this stuff. All right. So series two, packet number three. Let's see it. 
I really am ripping poor KK's face over here on the front of the packet. So we've got, I'm, I haven't to this day had any mice on the island. So this is Bettina. These guys, I really do, they are absolutely adorable. Kid, I've seen this many times, villager hunting. I keep thinking it's, um, what's his name? Uh, Sherb, but he's purple. So I keep thinking it's him and I keep wanting to get him, which we recently got. And then we've got Chip, who I think historically was the old fishing dude that's been replaced by whatever his face is name. I can't think of him right now. Anyone care to help? Oh, chum chum, it's always chumming. Following? What? So I'm doing it wrong. So I've been doing opening these wrong. Well, come and show me how to do these because obviously I'm doing it wrong. Okay, I'm here. So you're the resident card opening expert. So I am. how am I supposed to open this better? Okay, well, so go from the back. Yeah. Pull this open. Yeah. And you pull down the side. Oh, that's that's a lot easier. Okay. Cool. All right. Thanks, producer. Okay. Thanks for that. Always willing to learn something. Ah ha 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 ha. I found this little cutie. Everyone hates this person. I love it. So she's absolutely cute. So Coco, the freaky looking um, rabbit. Uh, speaking about weird looking, this is big mouthed uh, Prince, who's a frog. Pretty sure I would not invite this person to the island. And as they call these guys in Australia, copper so policeman so that's those so let's try this new uh this new technique i don't know if i've learned the right way or not opens easier thank you producer so we have in this deck we've got wendy who's another sheep Followed by the European Vladimir and this guy, who again is from previous Animal Crossings, Reese. It's a llama of sorts. It's pretty cool. Or an alpaca. It's an alpaca. It does tell you what sort of thing they are. And meanwhile, let's See if this is going to work again. I'll bollocks that one up. Okay. This one is Big Top, the elephant. This guy, I've been looking around the place. So, Agent S with a cute little number two. And this guy's very adorable, Porter. He's a little uh, monkey. That's cute. So that's all of the cards that we've got. So in those decks, in that particular order, was something like. And I did find out that the guy that has been replaced, we did remember that it's called CJ. So the new fishing, fishing guy. So these are the, the decks that we've got in this series. Let's clear some space. Bring on the next set. Oh, sorry, I just wanted to get onto the. Um, I'm very curious to see what happens if I go to the. Um, into the town centre, just to see what happens with, with this. So I'm just picking one of these random uh, special cards. I'm heading to the Nook Stop. So I'm going to invite a camper. So let's see what this does. Yes. Okay. 
I don't know if these work. Fail to read Amiibo. Okay, let's try that again. So maybe you can't do it here. Read again, sure. So should we try... We'll try this, Olivia. That's Olivia's Amiibo. So it does... It does pick up the non-special cards for uh, inviting to campsite, which I'll just say never mind for this time. But what I might do is... I'll pause that for now. I'll come back to see. I think you can invite it to Harv's Island for that. So let's see if... Let's open the next one. So we're now started onto Series 3. So they come in blue, and again, it's a little bit different to the American series, so you only get three. So in Australia, these were released today as a pre-order for $4.95 each, which is relatively pricey for a set of three cards. This one I keep seeing, and I'm not sure who it reminds me of, but this is the mouse Greta, who's kind of cute. Probably of all the mice, probably the cutest one I've seen so far. And another goat. So this is Velma, who looks like it's a girl, I think, by the looks of it. Velma's a girl's name, I presume. And then I was informed, because I completely missed this month, but this is the matching one to Reese, which is a whole suite to itself. So this is where you start collecting marital sort of like equipment and items to get married. So apparently these two get married, I think a good source was telling me. So these two get married, I think. So we're soon to find out. So we're in May at the moment. So we'll find out what these guys are all about. Okay, next one. I think I'm still need to work on this card opening technique. Okay. That's kind of cute. It's a little bit interesting. So it's a racing horse. <laughs> with the uh, the number and the uh, the bridle on it, freckles. It's another duck. It is cute. Very wide spaced eyes, isn't that for a duck? Let me find another duck. Oh, this is cool. Visit this person daily. Always disappointed that I haven't quite finished the collection, but blathers. Always trying to expand that museum collection. So he's very cute. Actually, that is another one I wanted to get. So I do want to get Blather's sister, Celeste. She would be cute to find, which I don't remember which series she's in. I think she's in probably in each series. Each one's got its own. Oh, this one looks like uh, a little funny because this is the uh, a mouse that's actually a play on cheese so cheddars cheddar cheddar looks like swiss cheese and another funny looking monkey so this is tammy by the looks of it spot with an eye and japanese <laughs> what happened hey so just recapping some of these. So we've got Cube for this one, which is a X'd out eyes penguin, which some would find a little bit scary, but I think it's cute. Daisy is another popular somewhat. I think it's popular. There's another dog that I can't remember. And this guy, Don, who again looks like a mole. And I think we've covered off, so these are some other cards that were already looked at. So this is all the ones we opened up earlier. So we had Stinky, uh, Crackle we spoke about earlier, and Pally, Pelican. We've got Violet, someone needs hopping for. <laughs> This one got me a little bit excited earlier. It wasn't on camera, but uh, Marina is on our one of our islands, so very cute. Just a normal 
octopus, but very, very cute. And Jingle, which is a, uh, I guess, a reindeer of sorts. And, and I think we got to this one, but again, I'll just recap just in case. So in this pack, we had uh, Chatter, who's made of cheese, which like a few of these animals in the series reflect what they're built from or play on their words. And this is Tammy who's a red-eyed monkey and kimono-wearing Isabel, who always looks cute. Who doesn't look cute in a kimono? And I'm not sure if we captured this before, but again, I'll just mention it again, just in case. Um, Cirrus, who marries Reese, I think, in the marriage series, I've been told, which I completely missed during last year. So maybe I'll experience it in June this year. So I think that covers off all of series three. But we still have another five left to go for series four. See you in a bit. Somehow that makes me excited. Okay, now I did get Harv's Island ready to go before. So I do want to find out what happens if we Hey, cameraman, can you see the, can you see that okay? Let's see if we um, can drive this upside down. Let's go with NFC, yes. I think you do it from here, from memory. Or do you have to bring up the, Layla can't be invited to Photopia. So what's the point of these guys on Switch? An Animal Crossing. I'm not sure, aside from collecting them all. Maybe it doesn't do anything. I'll see if I can do that off camera. All right, so we've got these five packs left. The sixth pack was here somewhere. I don't know where it is. It's all in front of me, which you can't see. These are the last few of this deck. So we have Cranston, who's a, um, what is this, an ostrich? <laughs> so one of the cool looking dogs, so this is Shep, so he's got his eyes covered, as dogs do. And this one I have not seen before, but this is intriguing. Katrina, who almost looks like uh, Anka, the cat. Again, I need to do some homework on this uh, series because I've got no idea what these ones are about. Who knows which leaf it is, uh, which, uh, whether it's New Leaf or some other animal series, animal crossings. Uh huh. Rory, the lion. I think I need to sack this cameraman. We got Boone. So do stick around. This is our first ever video for Animal Crossing. So this is a a gibbon, sort of gibbon, or not? And Shrunk, who uh, is that? Know what that is? What is it? Maybe an axolotl. It looks like one. I don't know. It looks like a what? Some sort of crazer. Some sort of crazer. That dinner does smell good inside. Oh, we got some more representation by the Australian community by Walt. So it's one of the kangaroos. Pretty fancy looking kangaroo. Dressed up in his, what is that? I thought it was a suit to start off with, but it almost looks like pajamas or some sort of um, karate outfit. Dizzy, who always used to run around on that one of our islands. And Rosetti. Is all okay? Who looks like is related to that other dude. Last two. Last two. This has been a pretty good 
collection. I'm pretty pretty happy for my first ever opening. Lobo. Elma, another horse. We don't know. I haven't seen this one before, actually. And there we go. Oh, yeah. We got Blather's little sister. I think it's a little sister. Anyway, it's the one everyone wants on the island to collect all the astronom astronomical um, DIYs. Maybe she might be on that island tonight. Who knows? Last deck. A little bit sad. Probably need to buy some more. Oh, okay. Oh, this is male, 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 and then Olaf, who will go well with Annalise, could see them uh, going together, and Lottie, this one we had Lottie before, was it a different looking, it is Lottie, from series uh, oh, it's the same card. Sorry. I've got a dupe. I need someone to trade with. Who's going to trade with me? Will it be you? See you next time. So I've just been playing around with some of these cards because I noticed that one of them didn't work before. But I'm going to try with a few of these others. So Lottie can't be invited. However... Celeste, who is in Animal Crossing New Horizons, does seem to work. So, she's in there, which is kind of cool. So, I thought that would work. So, I thought I'd just go and try some of these other ones. So, these guys, in theory, are in Animal Crossing New Horizons. Does it work? Does it work? Does it work? No. What about Jack? I've seen him before on New Horizons. It wasn't working. Let's see if we can try that again. There's Jack. Jack's on. Oh yeah, there. It worked. That one worked. What about its partner? Where's its partner gone? The blue one. The blue one, there it is. So I don't know if you can see that from there. There it is. They're going to get married in Harvey's Chapel. So that's cool. Uh, where did this one come from? Over here somewhere. Annabelle. Oh, sorry, Isabel. Isabel could not read the amiibo. I notice it does happen that sometimes. There's it. Isabel's arrived. So let me just do the, um, the zooming side of things. But what I did notice is, even though Isabel's in what looks like a kimono, if I take Isabel again in this form, different series, so series one versus series three, It says Isabel is already in Photopia, uh, Photopia. So you can't add her twice. And obviously she only resembles what she looks like regularly. So any of these other ones? What about Timmy? Yeah, Timmy arrived. Got a little posse happening. Any of the others? These guys? Definitely not. Okay, so it said Rossetti cannot be invited. So it does actually say that. What about this guy's trunk? No. So that's it. So it looks like you can invite them for, for Topia, but just not the ones that aren't in the game. So we already did Timmy. So there you go. Pretty cool. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this first video of, I hope many, of Animal Crossing related videos. So if you do have any of these that you want to swap me for, I'm not sure how we can swap or trade. If you're in Australia, maybe we can. Leave some comments below. 
Give us a like, thumbs up, subscribe if you want to see more, and definitely give us some comments on other videos that you might want to see. I might even do some tours of our island coming up, so that would be good. Till next time, see you guys. Thank you.